What's up, everybody? Daniel, the Epic Gamer guy here, and my fiance. We're we're doing another munch pack challenge. If I can talk right. Not a challenge. Just see, I screwed it up. It's not a challenge. Okay. It's munch not pack a video. It's just foodies. Yeah, it's snackies. not a challenge. Yeah, that I've already screwed this up. And yes, I am wearing a teddy bear costume. It's my pajamas. They're they're extremely hot. He chose it, not me. I'm, just, I'm, I'm also very naked under here. TMI. <laughs> All right. Do you want to start this time? Yeah, I'll start. Okay. You know what I'm going to pick first? Where's the spicy nuts? Spicy nuts. Yeah. Nothing like a good spicy nut. Which is from... It's called Grunuts. It's from Columbia. Oh. The country, not Columbia, Missouri. Indifference. No. Don't worry. Yeah. Are they actually spicy? I, I love spicy food. So let's find out. Chili peppercorn, it says. Yep. Tastes like corn chips or corn nuts. No, he says they're not spicy to me. They might be to you because I have a very high spice level. Tastes like a Frito. Yeah. It's a got a kick to it though. Yeah, I feel it. <laughs> See, my spice level is higher. No, nope, yep. I don't do spicy stuff. I'm not going to die. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you should go with the soda next. No, we're not doing the soda next. <laughs> I'm not a baby. <laughs> All right. Those are delicious, by the way. Granets. Deep dish pizza Cheetos. I don't know if you can see that. Deep dish pizza. They're made by herbs or herbs. I'm not sure how to pronounce that word. And it's made in the good old U.S. Doesn't smell like anything. It's got some, you can see some seasonings on it. It looks like a Cheeto. It's like a Cheeto. No, I got that name wrong. It's made by hers with two R's. I thought it was herbs. Doesn't taste like Cheeto, but it doesn't quite taste like pizza. It's not bad, but it has no scent at all. It's not good either. Like there it's is better than last week's corn roll. That was gross. You don't taste the, the pizza until you swallow it. It kind of tastes like, you know, a combo, a pizza combo. Mm. In a way. It's not bad though. No, I like them. If they're made in the USA, how come we've never found those before? I don't know. I don't know either. Maybe not in our location. They are delicious. I get it. Well, they, they, I like them. They're made in Pennsylvania. So that's the East Coast. Oh, dang it, Dan. <laughs> I almost spilled them. They're made by hers. I don't know if you can... Yeah, you can see that. Get closer. There I'm we gonna go. poke them in the eye. <laughs> Alright, your turn. Okay. These aside. Here's, here's the corn nuts, which I plan on eating. Yeah, all those are yours. You, nope. Um, let's see. How about this guy? Alright, what is it? Eight kick. I guess that says chocolate. It's probably chocolate in whatever language that is. It's it's different language. It is from Turkey. The last box had some turkey stuff in it. Yeah. yeah you and they were good, so... All right, let's try it. Okay, let's see what happens. I can't get it open. <laughs> What's the machete when you need it? <laughs> Hopefully I won't have to break that out this video. Nope. Looks like a chocolate Twinkie almost. It really does. Holy cow, it's got like chocolate filling in the center.
It tastes like a ding dong. You're a ding dong. <laughs> You're not lying. It's really good. You know, it really does taste like a ding dong. Yep. It's got chocolate frosting in that vanilla. Yeah. In the middle. That's really good. That's really good. I'm going to need to go to the gym again after this. Huh. Um. What are we doing now? We'll do the gummies. Okay. They're flippies. We had some gummies on the last video. Flippies. Whatever a flippy is. They are from France. Ooh. Fancy. Fancy. They look like fish. They're French fish. French fish. Yep. How's everyone doing, by the way? We're snacking. Yeah. Hopefully you're quarantining yourselves and not going out any more than possible. Mm, this smells really good. I just sit here and snip it. And they look like little fish. They look like they're supposed to be sharks, aren't fish they? Fish or sharks or something. I think they look like yeah, they look, they look like sharks. That one's <laughs> different color. I don't like it. <laughs> they're good. No, they really are. Really chewy, but they're good. They got a really good flavor. Yeah, they do. Doesn't say what kind of flavor it is, though. Probably multiple flavors, I'm assuming. I don't know. Don't care, it's good. Yep. All right. I'm picking next. Yep. I'm going for the, the fruity bar. It's called the llama bar. The llama bar. It's made with, like, uh, fruity pebbles or something. I don't know. Chalk. From the U.S. It's made in the U.S.? I've never heard of it either. It looks like a Wonka bar. Carl, that kills people. <laughs> Did I win the golden ticket? Right, it's, it's cold in there. <laughs> you get to go to the chocolate factory. The sad thing is there's a few of my viewers that won't get that reference. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's in chunks. Ugh. It's a little disturbing color. It's like pink and mostly pink, but like brown and. It doesn't really have a scent either. Mm. It's like strawberry chocolate. It tastes like fruity pebbles. I love it because I love fruity pebbles. I want some more of those. It tastes like. I love that. That is a good flavored flavor. Flavored white chocolate. It's flavored white chocolate. Yeah, but you get that strong fruity pebbles taste too. That's the flavor. Mm. It's not bad. It's really sweet. It really is sweet. A little too sweet for me. I like it, but it's really sweet. I'm probably going to order some more of this. Okay, we're about halfway through. So maybe we should try to drink. Yeah. I forgot to grab cups. We need something to wash it down. Hold on, I'll go grab cups. I'll keep oh. you entertained while we're... He's getting cups. Yeah. If I don't die. <laughs> he's gonna die. I'll just read you this little fun facts that come in this book. Well, this book tells you what kind of snacks you get and where they're from and a little bit about the flavors. But there's some fun facts in here. Like, did you know in Ireland, everyone dons green on St. Patrick's Day? The, but the original color that was used in the celebration of this holiday was actually blue. That's what it says right there. Another fun fact. From Turkey. Istanbul's Grand Bazaar is one of the oldest and largest malls in the whole world. It was established in 1455 and spans 61 streets and has over 3,000 shops. That's really a big mall. And, yeah, those are the fun facts for today. I'm back. Perfect timing. 
let's check out this drink, which is from oh, me falling over. <laughs> Japan. Last week's drink was from Japan as well. But oh, yeah. here's the best thing. Everybody who knows me knows I'm a Coca-Cola fanatic. I'm a Coke addict. <laughs> the drink kind. Yeah, not the powder kind. Coca-Cola. Strawberry. So we're totally going to try that. I don't like strawberry, but I like Coke. So we'll see. Also, it feels like a sauna in this suit. I warned him. I told him he was going to get hot, and he didn't listen. Hey, this is a fast way to lose weight without going anywhere. <laughs> well, it's not pink like strawberry. It smells like strawberry. It kind of does. Mm. It doesn't taste like strawberry, though. But it doesn't taste like Coke either. No, it doesn't taste like Coke. It's but it, something. It's, it's more of a raspberry taste to me. It's not bad because it's Coke, but you know. Yeah. I wonder if I ever tried this before when I went to the Coca-Cola building in Atlanta a couple years ago. I don't know. <laughs> I probably didn't because it's strawberry. Yeah. I don't like strawberry. But that room you could try Coca-Cola from all over the world. It's delicious, but it doesn't taste like strawberry to me. All right, here's the lid. So it doesn't go flat. I'm flat. You're not flat. All right, there's only a few more things left that you want to do. Mmm. Let's see. No, no, okay, I'll, I'll pick these. I can guarantee I won't like those. They look like the cereal. Jolly Pong. And I don't like those. Made in jolly old China, I'm assuming? Um. Or is it Japan? South Korea. South Korea. Okay, that was way out. They're corn and wheat puffs. They look like those cereals that you can buy at the store that I don't like. Golden puffs? Yeah, I don't like those. I like them. That's what it looks like. It's got a lot of air in it. Don't pop it. <laughs> I was about to. I know you were. That yeah, scared the crap out of me. <laughs> um, Do you need help? Wait a minute. There's a, there's a thing. There we go. That made it he easy. He needs the machete. <laughs> Not this time. Can't take them anywhere. And it smells like golden puffs. Probably tastes like it. Which means I'm not going to like them. But I'm going to try it. Oh, man. I like them. I love it golden puffs. It does smell like golden puffs. It tastes like golden puffs. Then I'm not going to like it. It's like you're eating golden puffs. Yeah, because, they're golden puffs. Because you are. It's just pre named. That was very good. I well, see those just... are yours, too. Okay. <laughs> Those in the nuts. All right. Missed. Oh, it has an aftertaste. We're going to go with these because I know. Oh, sour. We have something like this in America. This could be America. I don't know. But they're sour straws. Sour stri sticks. Straws. Where are they from? I don't know. It doesn't tell? Um, in the Netherlands. Netherlands. So, is there anything like ours over here? I like that. This is our first thing from the Netherlands. So. Yeah. It better be good. Let's see. Strawberry, apple, raspberry, and tutti frutti. Well, I'm going to assume the green is apple, so I'm going to be safe with that. Okay. <laughs> Watch it be wrong. Green one. Well, I don't know what else it would be. I'm going with red because I always go with red. It's pie strawberry. Red's just my color. Oh, it's really pretty. It's good. Sour uh, apple. It's a little bit sour, but I kind of like sour things, so. I feel like that's strawberry. It's, it's kind of sour. Raspberry is probably the blue. Some is tutti frutti is probably yellow. I feel like I shouldn't have shoved that whole thing in my mouth. So I'm taking bites. That was a lot of <laughs> Do you need more Coke? <laughs> oh. Yeah, it was a lot of sour all at once. It's good. Rather than those puff things. I, I love both of them. So far, I haven't found anything I don't like. The corn roll from last week. No, I mean this, uh, this one. Yeah, in this particular lunch pack. It looks like the last three things are some kind of chocolate. You can never go wrong with chocolate. I almost choked on that. <laughs> Leave it candy. to me. 
Yeah, leave it to me to die during a video. <laughs> and not from the corona. Huh. All right. Your turn. I know what I'm going with. What are you going with? Mr. Brownie. Yeah, that looks good. It's a brownie. It looks like a cosmic brownie, but not. With chocolate candies. Was it made? I guess it's from Spain. That's our first Spain one. Ooh, a Spaniard brownie. A Spanish brownie. Spaniard. Spanish brownies. A Spaniard sounds like a dog. <laughs> I'm a Spaniard. <laughs> I can't do this. You need the machete. I almost did. <laughs> wow, that is really gooey looking. It is really gooey looking. It looks like it's, it's shiny. Yeah. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> it's also got a, like a Reese's Cup type wrap around it. Oh, there's two of them in there. So one for him, one for me. Yep. It's almost like it's got they, it. they made brownies. And it's also got like... And they didn't cook them all the way. That's how gooey it is. <laughs> yeah. It's got like M&M's on top of it. Oh, my nose is itchy because of my hair. Well, oh, that's gooey. Okay, I can honestly say I don't care for that one very much. It's stuck to the roof of my mouth. What? It's getting stuck to the roof of my mouth. Yeah. It's like peanut butter. It's that gooey. But it's really good. I like it. I like it. Nope, well, that's the first one I... I mean, it's not bad, but it's not great either. My fingers are all gooey and gunky. Not mine, I just shoved it all in my mouth. That's what she said. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I was actually waiting for that. <laughs> it was a bit delayed, but I guess. That's what I was chewing. Is my turn quit looking? I know. Let me finish my brownie. It's a good. <laughs> Sorry, Liz, you don't get any of this. Yeah, the brownie's all gone, Liz. We you mentioned can lick you, the wrapper. <laughs> we mentioned you during a video. You should be honored. <laughs> I'm gross now. You probably should have got some wet wipes. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't prepare for this video. No cups, no wet wipes. We just kind of threw it together. I mean, the only thing that was planned is my costume. I didn't plan that. No, I did. Because... I'm spontaneous like that. What what's next? Um, we'll do this one. So, it's a some kind of milk chocolate waffle. No. And it's from the UK. Yay, the UK. I have friends in the UK. They probably eat these a lot. I don't know. Probably, yes. Probably like Reese's cups over there or something. It's easy to open, that's good. It's a chocolate waffle. Whoa. It does look like a waffle. It really does. Ooh, it's, it's really bendy. <laughs> wow. Yeah, it's a chunk. <laughs> I'm a chunk. I'm trying to figure out what's in the middle. Caramel, maybe? It tastes like a star crunch without all the crispies. Yeah, it does. And it's really messy. Yeah, it is. Definitely next time we'll have wet wipes. Yeah. I'm going to wipe this on my bear costume. No, I'm kidding. I'm not doing that. I just washed that. I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, but it's messy. Yeah. No. I'm still recovering from the last mess. Man, I just took the wrapper and shoved that one all in my mouth. All right, we got one more thing left. Come on, let me recover. I'm still chewing on that thing. Yeah, you can finish chewing, and I will... We didn't even give a review of it. It tastes good, but it's chewy. Told you it 
It tastes good. It tastes like a Star Crunch with Dr. Yeah. Krispies. Yeah, that's right. You did say that. I was too busy chewing. I couldn't hear anything. <laughs> Can't take you anywhere. Okay. This next one is a Costa Dublon. Dublon. Dublon? Dublon. It's from Chile. It's supposed to be chocolate. They sent a lot of chocolate in this one. They must know I like chocolate. It's, is it individual? Sometimes a girl's got to have chocolate. Sometimes. Well, it's definitely chocolate. Well, what else would it be? Goofball. I don't know what, how to describe that taste. It's good. It's different. It is different. It's uh, maybe I mean, vanilla-ish. Yeah. And chocolate. Definitely wafer. Yeah. It's kind of like a, some co kind of cookie in there. Yeah, it's like a different version of a Kit Kat. Oh. That's that really good. Yeah, this munch pack turned out really good. Like I, I didn't really like dislike anything. There's things I like less than others, but yeah. There's two things I didn't like. Yeah, the jelly puff and the puff things and the spicy nuts. Oh yeah, I love the spicy nuts. Yeah. I'm eating every one of them. Well, we gotta save some for Liz. Yeah, that's true. Liz and Ryan, they can have a couple. Yeah, a couple. Just two, that's it. <laughs> one, one for each of you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Itty bitty little peanut, you know. Yeah. So. But, yeah, this this munch pack box was really good. Uh, we sh Do we have more coming? We get them once a month. Oh. We will be doing more munch pack videos then. Expect once a month. I signed up for six months and then we can go from there. Okay, that's six videos. So yeah, expect At least. Yeah. Expect more munch pack videos, guys. This was really delicious and messy. I'm still full of chocolate. <laughs> so yeah, um, let us know what you think in the comments. Leave a like guys, subscribe. I will leave a link for munchpack.com in the description. And uh We'll see you in the next video. Peace. Bye.